and you rollin' with your team, pray your dog strong. When you slip, nigga, tell me who you fall on, huh? Who you fall on? Yeah. What's poppin' with y'all, man? I'm Devon, and you are now tuned in to Devon TV. Hey, man, today I'm doing my first Adam Calhoun reaction. I just discovered Up Church. I did like two or three reactions of him on my channel. And in the comments, I've been seeing his name, Adam Calhoun. I searched his name on YouTube. First video that came up was Racism. That's a heavy title already. I'm curious to see what this song is about. I haven't heard it before. I never heard Adam, Adam Calhoun before. I never, this is a real time, first time reaction in real time. So I'm curious to see what this song is about just based off the title alone. Let's get straight into it, man. Adam Calhoun, Racism, Raw Reaction, starting right now. <laughs> All right, man, so let's see what my guy Adam is talking about. I'm gonna start screen recording. Three, two, one. Bang, we screen recording, man. Let's see what Adam talking about, man. Racism, let's go. Hillbilly, nigga, white trash, fuck you, nigga. Okay, so. I'm getting a feel for what this song is about. Off rip, the song starts with, you know, some racial slurs from both sides, black and white, you know, N word, you know, the cracker, you know, all, you know, back and forth. So, okay, let me spin this back, man. Let me spin it back. Hell, Billy. Crack your ass, crack it, got your rubber flag with your camo hat backwards. Stains on your shirt with your fucked up teeth. Piece of shit truck broke down, middle of the street. Old lady bitching in the passenger seat. Smoking like a chimney, kids in the back can't breathe. Got a kid on her lap, smack his ass if he speaks. Always wearing white feeders cause her ass can't be. Okay, that's white trash, but what about it here, really? Redneck mother... Okay, so... You know, he just broke down what people consider white trash, right? And, I, you know, it, it's giving me the feel of uh, Joyner, Luca, Joyner, Joyner Lucas, pardon me, um, song, I'm Not Racist. He's just basically, you know, speaking from the perspective of, you know, I guess each group, like, you know, what people, the stereotypes people would throw at or the slurs people would throw at at a person they consider white trash. Now he about to get into Hillbilly. Man, okay. I like the creativity, man. Any kids in the back can't breathe. Got a kid on her lap. Smack his ass if he speaks. Always wearing white feeders cause her ass can't be. Okay, that's white trash, but what about it here, really? Redneck motherfucker, never even near a city. Out in the woods, hunting deeper than the wolves. Get that big old buck, bring them home, eat until they fall. Or they out in the shed, on the side, drinking shine. Old lady bitch, you better bring your ass aside. It's way past nine. You yeah, so he just broke down like what people stereotypes people see it, a hillbilly as. And besides the content and the subject matter, um, I love the flow. I like the beat so far, and I just like how he's delivering it. I like the flow. I like you know he he he's rapping and he's delivering in a way that it keeps you listening. Oh man, I mean. Me being from New York, um, I never really witnessed uh, too many like seeing the point of view or seeing somebody I considered like that I would, that that would fit the stereotype of a hillbilly. Like you know what I mean? I never really witnessed that because I guess that's more like the country. I'm more in like a city area, but I definitely got family in the South, and I you know I've been to the South, so yeah. I don't care, kiss my ass. I don't care, kiss my ass. They call me redneck, white trash, say it bad. I don't care, kiss my ass. I don't care, kiss my ass. They call me redneck, white trash, say it bad. I don't care, kiss my ass. I don't care, kiss my ass. They call me redneck, white trash, say it bad. I don't care, kiss my ass. 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 I don't care, kiss
I'm pretty sure I never have been caught out my name or a racist, a racist slur towards me personally, face to face. But I'm pretty sure it's people that might have came across me and might have been like, oh, this N word or this, you know, big black guy or whatever. But, bro, I don't give a fuck. I am who I am. I don't give a fuck what you think about me. So I, I respect that from him. Like, look at me how you want to look at me. Call me what you want to call me. But I don't care. Kiss my ass. And that's how I feel wholeheartedly. Fuck you ever for nigga ass nigga got your sagging pants with your ass hanging out the back hanging out in front of liquor store Okay, okay, so now he broke down what they look at, you know uh, uh, Trello Park track, you know Trello Park Hillbilly whatever now he we're gonna get into the black guys side of it, okay Got your sagging pants with your ass hanging out the back Hanging out in front of liquor stores selling crack Just so you could put some 24s on your Cadillac Baby mama bitch, you ain't taking care of business All you do is smoke weed, run around with no. other bitches Can you It's always that cool ass white boy, right? In every hood that be hanging with the black guys that You know, when he might get the N-word pass Some people might give it to him It's always that cool white boy, man <laughs> You could put some 24s on your Cadillac Baby mama bitch, you ain't taking care of business All you do is smoke weed, run around with other bitches And you can't keep a job, cause you in and out of prison Guess it must be Trump's fault, cause you making bad decisions That's about niggas, but what about black folk? Raise their kids right, every night, mom and dad are home Hunting for a job, not crying about a privilege Crying out the God, stop the violence where we live in Fuck it though, you a nigga, and I'm just a cracker They pin us against each other, sit back and they watch it happen In the hood they sell a crack and killing over shoes and jackets In the trailer park they fall apart, a bunch of mad daddies Call me redneck, white oh. trash, say it bad, I don't That's so true, man It's a thing that we call divide and conquer You know, if they divide us, the upper powers can... You know what I mean So, they put us against each other, man Like, racism... It's taught, you know what I mean? You're not born racist. You're taught that, you know what I mean? So I feel like anything that you learn can be unlearned if you want to, you know what I mean? If that makes sense to you. So, man, I'm feeling this so far, bro. I'm feeling this so far. They call me redneck, white trash, say it back. I don't care, kiss my ass. I don't care, kiss my ass. They call me redneck, white trash, say it back. I don't care, kiss my ass. I don't care, kiss my ass. They call me redneck, white trash, say it back. I don't care, kiss my ass. I don't care, kiss my ass. They call me redneck, white trash, say it back. I don't care, kiss my ass. I don't care, kiss my ass. They call me redneck, white trash, say it back. I don't care, kiss my ass. I don't care, kiss my ass. Man, I like that, bro. I like that a lot. Let me stop screen recording. All right, we've done screen recording. Man, that's powerful, man. Super powerful. Um, I always say this, like, black, white, Hispanic, Asian. I think if we take time to have the conversation, we'll realize we're more alike than different. Um, and I feel like if we're willing to have the conversation, we'll understand we, some of us, you know what I mean? Face the same struggles and go through the same things. Like, you know what I mean? Like we, how a white person that's racist will stereotype me in a certain way and automatically see me in a certain light. Black people, we do the same thing. So it's like, you know, we, if we, if we can understand that, bro, we're more alike than we are different, man. And we can overcome and unlearn that dumb racist bullshit. Like, man, the world can be changed, bro. We can, we're, we're more powerful united than divided. You know what I mean? But we got to have compassion for each other first. It starts with love and compassion. If there's no compassion and sympathy and love for each other, it'll never be changed. We can't fake it. It has to be genuine compassion for each other. You know what I mean? Because, like, I don't know, man. It's, this, this just got my mind, like, thinking, bro. Like, this was heavy, man. Shout out to shout out to this dude, man. Shout out to Adam Calhoun. I'll definitely be digging through his catalog and doing more reactions to him. Um, aside from just the content and what the song is about, 
he's a dope rapper. You know what I mean? Because it takes a dope rapper, a dope lyricist to craft those words and paint that image so vividly and so well. Um, so that just tells you how dope of a rapper he is. This is my first Adam Calhoun uh, reaction, my first song I'm ever hearing from him. So I'm curious to see what else he got, man. Hey, man, shout out to you guys for putting me on to him. I'm going to wrap up this reaction here. I hope you enjoyed it. I hope I said a lot, but I hope it made sense, man. Yo, thank you guys for helping me hit 400 subscribers. We're almost at 500. If you're new to the channel, man, please hit that subscribe button. Turn on post notifications. I post seven days a week. So you know when I post, man. Welcome to the community. Man, I appreciate you guys. My day ones, I love you. I'm an artist. I'm a rapper myself. If you're interested in hearing some new music you never heard before, I'm an upcoming rapper. Check out my EP, Not For Sale 2. It's fully produced by my best friend, Noko Beats. He's a producer out of Ireland. Yo, just check us out, man. I think I'm a pretty cool rapper. I think I'm okay. So let me know what you think. Drop it in the comments. If you have any more Adam Calhoun suggestions, requests, put that in the comment as well, man. Yo, I got three things I want to leave with you before I go. I want you to please stay safe, stay healthy. Last but not least, but this is the most important one. Stay sucker free. My name is Devon, and I thank you so, so much for tuning in, man. I'll catch you in the next video. Peace. When you rolling with your team, pray your dog strong. When you slip, nigga, tell me who you fall on, huh? Who you fall on?